What's good, y'all? King Carlos and his bitch. Well, I want to speak on the uh situation with uh Gilly. You know what I'm saying? Gilly the kid. Speaking of talking about how Jermaine Dupree, I think, or somebody he said people are gonna try to ban him from Atlanta. That's all that shit. For him saying what he said about, you know, them opening it up and, you know, trying to use basically what they're trying to do. Use black use places where they know um Negroes frequent and stuff like that. And pretty much minorities in general. You know, open them up and use them for control groups. Which is 100% evil, my nigga. You know? It, it just is what it is, bro. I don't... And you know what? We so far in history and time and so many events have happened. Why the fuck are people not catching... The fact that people don't catch on that shit, that lets you know, bro, what y'all y'all gonna go. So, you know, man. What's that, man? Give me the kid who's speaking on some shit, man. He was speaking the truth. Jermaine Dupree came out, but like he said, you worried about the image and shit, fuck an image, my nigga. See, that's how you know you got money. And this is, and this is another thing, too, I want to talk about, not even just the money. Listen, guys, be positive and be happy and know who you are, bro, before you get money, my nigga. Don't, don't be like these rap niggas. Because a lot of these niggas will sit up and tell you, man, it's about your health. Like, don't get twisted. It's about, be about your health. Be about your happiness now, bro. Don't wait till you get money. Because you got niggas, these niggas, is, these niggas are hoes, bro. They, they're not truthful. They do fake ass shit. All right, give you an example. You got a nigga like Gucci, man, bro. Sit up and say, health is wealthy, happy. You know what I'm saying? It's about happiness. It's about... But, bro, Gucci Man is the same nigga that admitted when he was broke, he was robbing people and, and trying to kill people, and he was hateful and bitter. So you're really a hateful, bitter person. You just got money. See, that's why I say these niggas is fake, man. They tell you who they are if you pay attention. So you're really just a thief. And I, and I know people say, hold on, you fuck with Gucci Man music? Yeah, I do fuck with his music. But I'm not really just calling him a thief like because he a thief because everybody makes mistakes. But the fact that you niggas don't come out and say, you know what? I know what it's like because I was bitter. I was angry. And I know what it's like to be a hater because I was a hater, my nigga. You know what I'm saying? I was hateful. I was I was looking at niggas that had more than me and wanted to take their shit, bro, and then no one want to work for it. Because you was. You niggas know, niggas know how that is, man. You know? These these niggas these niggas wait till they get money. You got niggas like all these niggas, man. All Kevin, Kevin Gates. Who else be on them? Pop, P. Diddy. All these niggas that be on that positive kick. Ask these niggas who they was before they got money, bro. When they was in your position, they was probably a hundred times worse people than you. That's how they got to their position, my nigga. That's how they got all that bread. Shit, come on, man. Yeah, what they didn't Gucci said? Yeah, Gucci man, happy and healthy, bro. Look, I rock with your music, my nigga. But, but y'all niggas gotta be honest and admit, admit that y'all was bitter ass, hating ass niggas. Just like all, just like y'all say, everybody else is that don't got money, my nigga. When y'all didn't have money, y'all not like the people that's positive and happy and actually worry about their health right now when they ain't got no money. Y'all hate on niggas like that. Matter of fact, when y'all meet niggas like that or y'all hear niggas like that speaking on y'all and y'all can look and tell that they happy and content with their life, they don't need nothing else. That's why y'all quick to call them broke, my nigga. That's why these niggas, these favorite, listen, but they, be, they don't just talk about rappers. They talk about you and me. me. All of us, when these niggas get bitter and mad and wrong, that's all, all, all. The first thing they say is you broke. It don't matter, my nigga. Just because you broke, that don't mean you happy. Just because you broke, you dead. Just because you, I mean, I mean, just because you rich, that don't mean you happy. And just because you rich, bro, that don't. And just because you rich, that don't mean you no real nigga, bro. Just because you got money, that's another reason I say, bro, you can't stop fucking. With you. Like, ain't nothing wrong with fucking with the music, but y'all gotta stop personally, like listening to these niggas, man. Look at who these niggas was when they was in the hood. Now the niggas who was, who was. Who was who was had the same energy they got now, even if it's negative, and they got it now. They didn't change. They kept it the same, or at least if they did change positive, they admitted that it was the money and shit that helped them change positive. That's the niggas you fuck with, man. Them are the niggas you 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 you, you um you listen to the niggas who who put out them these quotes. You got a nigga like NBA Youngboy, man. You was a bitter hating ass nigga, bro. Come on, man. You stole from your cousin Boozilla. 
You stole from fucking uh you stole from Lil Hurt and you stole from fucking um G Money. Got out the city, got money, still hated on this. You had a deal, still hated on this motherfucker. We all know what happened. And now that niggas and, and see now that a nigga see and see what it is, bro? Niggas are hateful and jealous and bitter of other niggas. And they feel like they can't live life until that person's dead. But you still can't live life. You're still a hateful, bitter, depressed ass nigga, man. These niggas is they can't listen to these rap niggas, bro. They fake. These niggas is pussy. These niggas ain't shit before they get money. They haters, thieves, bitch ass niggas and hoes, nigga. Straight up. These niggas ain't real, bro. These niggas wait till they get money to tell you all that positivity. I'm telling you right now, bro. I live in a regular apartment. Nigga, be positive. Love yourself, nigga. Love your life, bro. Every time a motherfucker get mad and think about what he don't got, you miss the smallest tidbits. And by the time a motherfucker think about it, it's time to get the fuck up out of here. You dead, nigga. Think about that. Why y'all listen to these fucking stupid ass rappers, bro? These dumb ass niggas. I'm sick of these, all these dick riding ass fans with all these fucking... Fan pages of all these things, these young boy fan pages and shit. Y'all niggas are stupid, man. Get off a nigga dick. Quit sucking, you fucking faggots. Y'all niggas is pussy, man. Come on, man. What's wrong with y'all, bro? These niggas is bitter, thief ass niggas when they ain't got money. Now that they got money, they nigga, you ain't up. You a hoe. Straight up. All of y'all. All y'all. Ain't just him. Damn, what I do to my finger? I feel like I just broke that motherfucker. Ain't just young boys. All these niggas, man. All you niggas that act like now you got money and niggas is mad, man. Niggas ain't even hating on you. Sometimes niggas calling you niggas out for the truth. I don't get it, man. I don't get these. Get you weird ass niggas, man. Niggas sit up and tell me I was the thief, nigga. I was a rock dope boy. The nigga get married. Talk about some What? Put a fifty million dollar ring on your wife and dare a nigga to look at it. You ain't gonna, man. Nigga, shut up. Shut the fuck up, bro. Shut the fuck up. You the same motherfucker talking about prison changed my life. But you talk about a nigga saved? Come on, bro. Whatever. What, 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 what this nigga Gucci man say about? Who was you talking about, my nigga? I don't know who the fuck is. I think this, this nigga was talking about Frenchie or something. Come on, man. Prison saved my life. I'm glad I didn't get 20. I thought you said if you got 20, you'd jump the fence. Listen, I fuck with you niggas musically, but personally, bro, y'all do a lot of bitch-ass, hoe-ass shit, my nigga. And y'all don't stand on nothing morally. Just because you niggas got money, you swear that make you real, and you honestly think you're untouchable. But if somebody white walk up on you and call you a bitch and slap you, you don't do shit, ho. You only do something to your own people, you fucking bitch. 